A major part of my job as a medical assistant and reception at a doctor's office is answering the phone. I have learned that the person you are talking to on the phone can tell you are smiling by the tone of your voice. I try to always remember and be aware of this when I am answering the phone or making a phone call at work. I know you may be thinking, I know how to answer the phone, but there is always certain etiquette to use when answering the phone in a medical office. When you greet the caller on the phone, greet somebody like you're meeting him on the street for the first time or anywhere else or anybody or anywhere else with a casual greeting like good morning, good afternoon, or how are you doing? Next, state your name and where you're calling from. So the caller knows that they have reached their correct destination and you can continue on with the telephone phone call. Last, after you state who you are and where you're calling from, ask the caller how you could help them or if you could direct their call to the correct party. All the while, while you're greeting the caller on the phone, make sure to keep a smile on your face because the caller can always tell you are smiling by the tone of your voice. While talking to the caller regarding the message, make sure you are actively listening to them and they are actively, actively listening to you by acknowledging with the yes ma'am, yes sir, or by repeating what they have said. If the patient or caller wants to set up an appointment in the doctor's office, give them an option of available days the doctor is in the office. To make it easier for the patient, Give him two available times in the morning and in the afternoon and what is convenient for the patient. When you're done making the appointment, repeat back to the patient the time and date and, and the location of the appointment so you could verify that this is what they wanted. If the patient would like a prescription refill, always remember to get the name of the prescription and how to spell it if the patient knows and the strength of the prescription. Also remember to get the name and the number of the pharmacy the pr patient will like the prescription to go to. We always remember that not all medical offices have electronic medical records yet, so they don't have on file the pharmacy the patient usually likes to use. Finally, in getting a prescription refill for a patient, remember to get a phone number the patient can be reached back at so you can call the re patient back to let them know their prescription has been filled. If the caller would like to leave a certain message for the doctor regarding anything, always remember to take a detailed message for the doctor regarding what the patient would like to tell. Make sure to get the patient's name with the correct spelling of their first and last name. Also remember to take a brief detailed message about what the caller is calling regarding. Make sure the most important part is to get a ret return phone call number so the doctor or whoever the message is for can return the patient's phone call. Also, don't forget to, re to repeat the message back to the patient or the caller so they know that you got the whole correct message and understood what they were saying. Closing. When you are finishing the message from the caller or finishing out what you have said to the person you called, make sure to say thank you and repeat what you have told the p person on the phone. And also, remember to close with a salutation by saying, have a nice day, hope to hear from you soon. And this is how you could have proper etiquette for talking on the phone in a medical office. Everyone thinks it's just like how you would normally talk on the phone. But in a medical office, it's more important because patients' lives are at stake every day.